Hello, good morning. This is your Daily Outlook for Tuesday, the 23rd of July. The euro continues its bullish trend, moving above 131.95 against the dollar. The pair strengthened as US home sales came out worse than expected. The negative results may delay tapering of quantitative easing by the Fed, leading to lower lows for the dollar. The US dollar has slid below 99.28 before correcting to 99.51 against the Japanese yen. The yen has strengthened as Prime Minister Abe won a key vote which will allow him to further follow his structural reforms in the country. Looking at equities, the UK 100, tracking the UK's largest corporations, has closed on a positive note and is looking to open higher. News of the birth of the heir to the throne may be just what's needed to boost the UK economy. Looking at commodities, WTI crude oil looks at correcting some of its massive previous gains, touching 106.92. The price of West Texas Intermediate had for the first time in years touched the price of North Sea Brent as distribution restrictions ease. Now let's take a look at what the currencies are doing this morning. The euro dollar pivot point is at 131.60 with a preference to enter into long positions at 131.60. The dollar yen pivot point is at 100.15 with a preference to enter in short positions at 100.15. The Aussie dollar pivot point is at 0.9180 with a preference to enter into long positions at 0.9180. The sterling dollar pivot point is at 152.95 with a preference to enter into long positions at 152.95. And the dollar cap pivot point is at 103.65 with a preference to enter in short positions at 103.65. Now let's take a look at commodities and indices. The oil pivot points at 108 with a preference to enter into short positions at 108. The gold pivot points at 1318 with a preference to enter into long positions at 1318. The silver pivot points at 2005 with a preference to enter into long positions at 2005. The US 500 is at 1675 with a preference to enter into long positions at 1675. And the UK 100 is at 6530 with a preference to enter into long positions at 6530. And of course, for more up-to-date information, please visit us at easy-forex.com. And watch out for these market movers at 8.30 GMT in the UK. We have the BBA mortgage approvals expected at 38.5 thousand. At 12.30 GMT in Canada, we have the core retail sales month-on-month forecast to rise by 0.1%. And at 1300 GMT in the US, we have the HPI month-on-month forecast to rise by 0.9%. And our mover and shaker of the day is the US dollar moving to lower lows, touching 103.21 against the Canadian dollar, just ahead of this afternoon's retail sales increase. A release of more than 0.1% may push the loonie higher than its US peer. Thank you for tuning into our daily outlook. We look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. I'm Amara Joe from Easy Frog's Dealing Room. Have a great day. Not only have you found a great place for Forex news, you found a great place to trade it. Registration is easy. Just click join now. Membership has its unique benefits, such as the freeze rate, the trade simulator, the inside viewer, and personal dealers. Your personal account manager waiting for you now.